welcome to vinuta's math channel this is the 12th question of the probability distribution module the question is if x is a discrete random variable taking the values 1 2 3 and so on with p of x is equal to 1 by 2 into x by sorry 2 by 3 whole power x if so find p of x being an odd number we have to find the p of x as an odd number that is 1 3 5 in the previous problem we had uh, uh, we had the similar problem where they were asking us to find the probability of x being even there we had taken 2 4 6 by first establishing that p of x is a probability function First, they are asking us to prove this as probability function. That is, P of X, summation of P of X must be equal to 1. We have to prove that at the first stage. Then we have to find P of X being an odd number. This is an homework for you. Uh, you can solve this problem just like the previous problem. That is the 11th problem. What we had solved in our previous video. Let me show you how to solve the third, 13th question. Okay, The 13th question is the range of random variable x is equal to 1, 2, 3 and so on. And the probabilities of x are such that p of x is equal to k which is equal to lambda power k divided by k factorial where k varies from 1, 2, 3 and so on. If so, find the value of lambda and p of x which lies between 0 and 3 so what we have to find first lambda and then p of x p of x where it is ranging between 0 and 3 fine our first problem is lambda find out lambda it is a probability function so summation of this will be equal to 1 summation of p of x will be equal to 1 why because they are telling it as a probability function which is equal to summation p of x is lambda power k divided by k factorial which is equal to 1 by using this statement we have to find the value of lambda now let us give the value of k k can take the values from 1 2 3 and so on right so k here from 1 2 3 so on up to infinity if i substitute k is equal to 1 here lambda power 1 by 1 factorial plus lambda power 2 by 2 factorial plus I am substituting the value of k that's it lambda power 3 k value is 3 so 3 factorial lambda power 4 by 4 factorial so on which will be equal to 1 fine which is equal to we have a formula here the power series formula that is equal to lambda power 0 by 0 factorial or any power 0 by 0 factorial plus lambda power 1 by 1 factorial plus lambda power 2 by 2 factorial plus lambda power 3 by 3 factorial so on up to infinity will be equal to e power lambda actually this power series uh, formula if it is in the form of e power x e power x is equal to x power 0 by 0 factorial plus x power 1 by 1 factorial so on for this uh, problem or for this statement i have rewritten like this that's it if i substitute for these value okay see here this value is here right so for this what i can substitute as e power lambda minus i'm taking this value here minus any power 0 is 1 0 factorial is 1 1 by 1 is 1 so this value will become e power lambda minus 1 so lambda power minus 1 
factorial divided by 1 factorial lambda power 2 by 2 factorial lambda power 3 by 3 factorial so on will be equal to e power lambda minus 1 let me consider this as equation 1 and this as equation 2 substitute substitute equation 2 in equation 1 so for this we can substitute as e power lambda minus 1 is equal to 1 as it is so e power lambda minus 1 if i send it here 1 plus 1 e power lambda will be equal to 2 if i take the anti log or the log when i apply the log here lambda will be equal to log 2 to the base e so we found the value of lambda as 2 to the log 2 base e the next question what we have to find out is p of x varies from 0 to 3 p of x which varies from 0 to 3 fine which is equal to from 0 to 3 what are the x values we get we have to exclude 0 also and 3 also so p of x is equal to 1 and p of x is equal to 2 only these two values we will get addition so p of x is equal to 1 the function is this is the function right p of x is equal to k is equal to lambda k lambda power k by k factorial so it is lambda k is 1 divided by 1 factorial plus lambda k value is 2 divided by k value k is 2 factorial is equal to lambda power 1 is lambda by 1 plus lambda square by 2 our lambda value is what we have found it is log 2 log 2 to base e log 2 to base e whole square i am substituting divided by 2 so p of x which lies between 0 and 3 will be equal to log 2 to base e plus log 2 to base e whole square divided by 2 after doing the calculation in your examination try to put a box okay so that the examiner or the evaluator will find this answer and give you the full marks don't do any mistakes in between if you do also don't rewrite anything on it fine if you like this video do hit the like button comment your opinion and answers in the comment box join our telegram channel the link will be provided in the description box share the video with your friends and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching and happy learning